I'm Carla Burns, a Senior Healthy Living Science Analyst at EWG, and I'm here to answer a few questions about our latest guide to sunscreens. More than a decade ago, EWG released its first annual guide to sunscreens to help inform consumers to make educated decisions around sun protection products. This year is our 15th annual guide to sunscreens, and our team of scientists reviewed more than 1,800 products. That includes recreational sunscreens, daily use products, products specifically marketed for babies and children, and lip balms with SPF. And in good news, more than 400 of those products met EWG's criteria. There are many factors to consider when trying to find that perfect sunscreen product for you or your family. This year we reviewed more than 1,800 products in our guide to sunscreens, and more than 400 of those products meet EWG's criteria and can be found on our best list on our website. But if you're trying to find a new product and not sure where to start, here are some tips to help you narrow down the field. Choose a product that has a mineral-based active ingredient. So look for the words zinc oxide or titanium dioxide on the product's ingredient panel. Also choose a lotion or stick. Skip the aerosol sprays and powder products. They may have inhalation concerns and may be more difficult to get that adequate even layer of protection on your skin. And when trying to narrow down an SPF value, EWG recommends you look for a number between SPF 15 and 50 plus. To learn more, check out our guide to sunscreens.